welcome back to my YouTube channel guys, Adam Raval. And if it's your first time, consider subscribing below. I'll do my best to keep you informed, entertained, inspired, and intrigued with all my YouTube videos. And as you can see the title of this particular video, this is another audition for The Voice of Poland. Well, you know, the blinds are still ongoing right now. And the contestant's name is... Alexandra Matika or Mataika, I most probably mispronounced that, but you know, my apologies. Anyway, you will see all the details of this video on the title uh, here. And um, I will be putting the link on this on the description box or in the pinned comment so that you can check it out for yourself. I believe this is like my fourth or fifth reaction video to The Voice of Poland and I'm really really excited to continue to watch and react uh, the journey of these contestants especially with those of the ones that you requested for me to react to alright so with that being said let's check this out this video and I may be doing past reactions I'm excited here we go Right, there it is, Alexandra Matika with Tuneha or Tunaiha. All right. Zaśpiewać tę piosenkę w tym programie jest aktem odwagi. Wierzymy w nią bardzo. Ze środka ksiąg Piękni Są z romansu tła Very, very low, however, a very, very soft um, vocal quality as well and a little bit of vibrato. Um, however, though, it seems as though we have, I don't know if I'm just be going to be the one, you know, who noticed this, but it seems as though the audio for the voice of Poland, especially on the singer's, um, you know, volume is not a little bit um, higher compared to the comments of the judges and also with the host. So I don't know if I'm the one who, you know, who observed that, but that has been like sort of what I've been noticing for the past reactions in the voice of Poland. It seems like the volume of the singing, the singers are just not as loud compared to the comments of the judges and also the hosts. But maybe it's just me. <laughs> Oh, I love that part right there. Quite unique vocal placement. Um, however, it seems as though that this may not be her natural voice. But like I said, it could always be wrong. I always take this videos, you know, with a grain of salt because obviously this is my first time reacting and watching the singers or this contestants. So basically, I can pretty much um, tell what I'm observing initially. <laughs> It's like it, she's using her mixed voice, but more on the heady mixed voice. That is why it could be lacking more power or more volume to it. So that, that's probably the reason why no judge or no coach so far has turned uh, for her yet. But who knows? Let's just, you know, watch some more. <laughs> Very, very nicely. Yeah, 
it seems like more on the very very heady falsetto tone it's really really beautiful but sometimes you know the, the problem with that is it, it doesn't have like the proper support like i said it would lack power emphasis in you know warmth and just be you know it's gonna be lacking some weight Oh, one whole thing. You see, on um, the last part, it seems as though she ran out of breath. Um, it could be that she was nervous the whole time, or the breath support was sort of lacking. Uh, let's try to um, backtrack, like maybe on the half part of the performance, okay? She's crying though, I think she's her mom or her sister perhaps, or pretty much, you know, loved ones. That part right there actually was really, really nice. Uh, very, very round uh, belt. And uh, at the same time, the support was there. The control was there. Yeah, she's crying. Even on the like on the last part when the coach turned, you can tell from her face as well that she was just like praying that she would be able, you know, the contestant would be able to make it through successfully without any hitch or whatever. But obviously, on the last part, it's quite uh, we can it's quite apparent that she ran out of breath and she was not able to extend or you know held that note, and you know to sustain that note basically. But anyway. It is really still um, good that she was able to make it through to the next level and congrats to Alexandra Matika and of course we'll be following her journey all throughout the Voice of Poland. Guys, if you still have any requests for me to react to, particularly for this contest, The Voice of Poland uh, 11, let me know below in the comments just the title of the video or you can just DM me at Instagram and Facebook as well. Alright, I'll see you in my next upload. Have an awesome weekend everyone. Bye!